Okay, you guys, we are here with Sabrina Baker right now. She is tending to her lovely plants. Like I've said before, if it's one thing that Sabrina loves outside of her cat, outside of her daughter, outside of the male Sims, outside of herself, is her garden. She loves nature. She loves to get her hands really deep and dirty into the ground with these plants but you know what that's that's what I love about Sabrina and you know I'm gonna take some time to talk about my sim Sabrina because she does become an elder in this particular episode so y'all know y'all already know the routine of what's gonna happen with this recording whatever oh my gosh I literally can't like you guys I get so emotional I don't know I mean I know why but like jeez like oh I, I just become way too attached to my sims especially my sims who are born like who are like birthed in the neighborhood oh my gosh okay oh my gosh Sabrina started off with only able to pay for the house that she lives in now with her cat she was able to meet some male sims i loved that her first love was that fireman like that was her first love the fireman still one of her first one of her loves not her first but you know he is still one of her many lovers but you know that's sabrina sabrina slowed down a bit when it came to fadaya she did she slowed down on like what she was doing when she had Fadaya, but she had a whole lot of fun. And she had fun with a particular sim, her baby daddy, Fadil. I don't know what it was. I y'all, I cannot tell you. I don't know what it was about Fadil that she just it was like crack. <laughs> like she couldn't let go. She had to keep going back and back and back. And y'all, they would woohoo like three times in like a night. Just keep going. And they were both rolled at once to just keep going. I'm like, y'all cannot stay away from each other. I just, I don't even know what to tell you. I mean, and that's how Fadiah was born. <laughs> I kind of wasn't really expecting her to have babies with any Sims. But she did have Fadiah before she had Fadiah, she kind of found out she was pregnant and then when she went to that wedding that was when she was like you know what you got me at y'all wedding but I'm gonna get y'all at this wedding and at the Campbell family's wedding is when Sabrina allowed Booker to you know flirt with her in front of his wife she didn't care you know <laughs> She just, she didn't care. She was just like, because it is what it is. Like, you think you had him. Girl, he wanted to marry me. I'm the one. I'm the one he wanted to marry forever and ever. And I told him no, y'all. She told Booker no, like, for years. She was like, no. Mm -mm. I'm Because she doesn't want that. She's a romance him. She's like, I don't want to get married. I don't want to do that. No, like, so I could just play your little housewife? <laughs> No, I don't want to play housewife. <laughs> I want to do what I do. I want to rack up on these male sims. So, yeah. That was the only time Sabrina really, like, allowed a male sim to flirt with her in public. She normally rejects a male sim's advances in public or, like, at another male sim's house. Like, if that's, like, her lover or something like that. She normally will reject it because she doesn't like drama to... You know, and I know, I know, I know it's crazy to say that she doesn't like drama and she's a romance sim. And she's dealing with a whole bunch of male sims, but Sabrina's mindset is she, she likes lovers. She likes the idea of having love with an S. She likes the idea of not just male sims, but even female sims just can't stop talking about how beautiful she is they can't stop talking about the attraction that they feel when they are near her they can't help it it's just that black girl magic they can't help it and 
I don't know if Sabrina has like regretted this in life. I personally feel like she hasn't, but I mean, I don't know. Sabrina has always been like that Sim that I've just kind of had to learn while playing her. I mean, I have to learn all of my Sims while I play them, but like I've had to learn when it comes to Sabrina that she doesn't really move like other romance sims while some romance sims they're very outlandish and they'll do x y and z whereas Sabrina is a very clear-cut straightforward and not only that but she's just she doesn't like the drama she really doesn't and if she doesn't have to deal with the drama she won't but she likes the lover she likes the attention that she receives just not the drama she stays away from the drama as much as she can the only drama that she really gets to it with is her baby daddy because baby daddy be tripping okay baby daddy be on some stuff but you know that's each their own you know <laughs> she leaves she leaves baby daddy alone to a certain extent so you know it's like to each their own so whatever but y'all this is sabrina she has been able to keep a happy home with being a single mom she is a single mom with being a single mom um her baby daddy is very active though he is he is very active very loving they are very much a unit they are they are very much a unit when it comes to Fadaya, but they're just not living in the same household because it benefits the both of them to not live in one household especially with what she would like to do <laughs> with her life so it's just it wouldn't have been beneficial to try to get them into a household or whatever the case may be like it's it would be counterproductive and if anything it would just cause a lot of drama i think sabrina has truly loved her life i think she really has y'all i think she has truly loved the life that she has had and we'll continue to have she's not gonna die um, well not, not now she's not gonna die right now but yeah i think she has truly had fun like she's had a crazy life but she's been able to keep the drama to a minimum she's been able to meet wonderful male sims that she can truly lean on and i love that for sabrina that she's able to find different aspects that she likes about different male sims and why she like loves them like she loves baby daddy because baby daddy can keep up with her um physical needs okay and then she loves like hakan because hakan is a nature sim just like she is so they can they understand each other like not just lover language but like mentally like that knowledge aspect and spiritually because like this is like nature isn't just their hobby it's like it speaks from who they are you know like <sighs> it's like your love language you know like and i'll just give you a quick example like if you're a gamer if you have a boyfriend your boyfriend's gonna be like hey what you know you need a day to yourself i'm gonna go buy you some snacks you go in there and you play your game or hey i'm gonna go buy you a new mouse because your mouse is jacked up some of y'all gamers your your mouses are jacked up get a new mouse and he's like i'm just gonna buy you a new mouse you know so it's little things like that like that's how i take it whenever i play sims i take it i know a little bit too seriously but you know like i said before this time is my time to like reflect on sabrina because she is about to be an elder so yeah she's she's come up she is my first sim to reach the top of her career be as it may it is a slacker career however it's still a career even though it's a slacker career it's still a career so she has done very well for herself and she's able to give a really good environment to Fadai where Fadai can feel free she kind of felt a little too free in the last episode and was about to woohoo with a teenage Sam and we're gonna talk about that when we get to Fadaya about my stuff when it comes to that but anyway but yeah you know i just very 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 happy for sabrina kind of i don't know i don't know how to feel about this next chapter and phase of her life 
um this party might be a little crazy because i am going to invite like all of her lovers and stuff because why not so this party might be a little crazy but uh that's what makes it fun you know but anyways oh my gosh i literally can't i am gonna have her take her pictures and whatnot because she does have to take her pictures y'all like i know look at this becomes an elder in two days i know she will take her pictures she only has to take two she only has to take two because she only has to take one for fadaya and one for herself because <sighs> when she passes you know okay anyways okay so this is the brenda baker she is my first black female sim that i created for this very diverse custom neighborhood she becomes an elder in two days she is a romance sim her ltw is to have 20 simultaneous lovers that's a lot you know but we're gonna get there she wants to be best friends with naldo flirt with goa she wants to make out with naldo and be best friends with waylon she fears being rejected for a flirt by naldo getting rejected for a kiss by naldo and falling out of love with aiden which honestly that just might happen you know that like that's uh, that honestly like just might happen okay so we were working on jay fairchild and they're almost lovers which is awesome that's awesome sauce right there <laughs> like i said we've been we've been working on getting her lovers and everything together so we're working on Jay. We are okay. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna say eleven, and then twelve here. So we need to get this up to thirteen. Get this up to fourteen, and then Jay would be like fifteen, and then they used to be lovers until she caught him cheating. So that would have been like sixteen oh my gosh y'all like we we're getting there we're getting there she wants to be who is waylon y'all i'm trying to figure out who who's this waylon guy oh my gosh y'all i don't even know who oh 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 period oh period 17 what is this 18 maybe like 19 y'all it's gonna take us no time to get there i hope so i hope it's gonna take us no time because yes we gotta do this okay um and look at this not even attracted to booker anymore that's crazy so to think that if i would have made her like if i would have forced zabrina to marry booker she wouldn't have even been attracted to him anymore look at that like the attraction went away <laughs> it, that's crazy how that works let me show you guys something very quickly okay so her relationship with yaa i spoke about this in the booker not, not the booker well oh well anyways in the anderson family's most recent episode i did speak about this <laughs> um i didn't know how sabrina felt about y'all i know i know and we know how y'all feels about sabrina and why she feels that way we all know but i didn't know how sabrina feels and now that i see this now i know that sabrina feels like y'all is a snooty no good female sam <laughs> like for lack of using other words <laughs> not lack of better words just lack of using other words yeah i feel like she thinks y'all is just a no good snooty that type of sam you know like she still don't like her that's so crazy they had a whole conversation and they didn't care to really talk but i guess they were just doing it just to be cordial y'all she oh, she could care less about her she also could care less about valentina jc andrea yeah that was the female sim carlos got caught cheating on sabrina with and she doesn't care for Celine. <laughs> i don't know she kind of doesn't care for these sims either she's just kind of like meh Nah. Yeah, she oh she <laughs> she doesn't really care for Fantasia. Okay. Where's the car? Okay, she kinda she's digging to hear a little bit. 
She's big into hearing a little bit. We're going to talk about why that's important. And her and Sakari are doing better. Not friends, because they don't have to be friends, but they're, they're all doing better. That's really, really good to see. Okay, so like I said before, she is at the top of her career in the slacker career she's a professional party guest and she makes 1400 simoleons and she doesn't have to go to work throughout the week only the weekend so yeah she be chilling she be big big chilling she has an amazing reputation her reputation level is sociable celebrity because period okay she is an aquarius just in case you have forgotten or you're new here I did give all of my Sims new bios. Why? Because we're at the 30-year marker. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited about that. Okay, so here is Sabrina's bio. Sabrina has worked hard all her life to get to the place she is now. She is content with her daughter and her cat. She has reached the top of her career field, and she can be with all the male Sims her heart desires. The only problem is will she be seen as the town's man stealer she can't help that everyone is attracted to her and she just wants to have a lover maybe two or ten what's wrong with feeling love from different male sims like what's wrong with that you're not gonna get everything that you need from one male sim so why commit to one who's not gonna give you everything that you need like why you know i feel like that's how she thinks about it like I said before, her hobby is nature. Her sub-hobby is gardening, like she's doing now. Okay, let's get into the last memory that we looked at for Sabrina, which... Oh, y'all was, was right here. Okay. The last memory that we looked at for Sabrina was that she met Naldo Allen. We know Naldo. We know Naldo. Okay, okay. She met Waylon Menon, who is an NPC. She met Waylon here at her place when we were playing her in the previous episode. Met Troy Go, who is an NPC. Met Troy here, like here at her place in the previous episode. She's not attracted to Troy. He's attracted to her, but it's not, it's not vice versa. It's not mutual. <laughs> so he's out as far as like lovers. Kissed Waylon for the first time. She sure did made out with Jay yep in the previous episode she made out with Jay made best friends with Jay and then she met Amani Nelson okay so this happened when she went to Chaquel Edwards get together so if you want to see that you're gonna to have to go and watch Chaquel Edwards most recent episode there Zabrina all of them they attend his little saturday get together it wasn't really little but his saturday get together and amani and all these other sims were there but amani was there and we know that amani is tahira's cat and sabrina loves animals like she looks she does she loves animals so she met amani nelson she met joe carr who is an npc and then she met nashine ziggler who is also another cat like i said she's just she loves cats and we know Nashine is Mila Ziegler's cat kissed Naldo for the first time okay so Naldo if you go and watch Naldo's most recent episode then you will see that <laughs> okay you will see that he saw Sabrina walking down the street and he was like "Ooh, that's the fat so he wanted to talk to Sabrina, kind of get to know her, and they started talking, and then they kissed, and then, of course, they woohooed. So they did woohoo, and that was about it. That's all that's kind of happened between them. There hasn't been, like, a make-out, like, like, she wants to do, she wants to make out, be best friends with him, and stuff like that. None of that has occurred as of yet, because we, we all know it's about to go down. Anyways, so yeah, she hasn't made out with Naldo or anything like that as of yet. And they're not best friends yet. And you're going to have to go and watch Naldo's episode to figure out, like, what happened there and what's going on in that particular mindset. But yeah, that is Sabrina. Also, they have a bunch of funds because 
one of her lovers brought it was like some it was a vase some people say vase <laughs> doesn't matter <laughs> tomato tomato and it was like a whole bunch of simoleons like I sold it and it was a bunch of simoleons so y'all already know where that where all that simoleons is gonna go I was about to say money you already know where all those simoleons are gonna go to her daughter mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm glad that you know I'm glad that you know oh you oh my gosh look at her baby you guys oh <laughs> uh, Sabrina remembers when she had Fadaya and she did not want to be pregnant <laughs> Sabrina did not want to be pregnant and she looked so good y'all Sabrina looked bomb and y'all are gonna see in this episode because she gonna get dressed up and be cute she looked bomb but this is her baby oh my gosh like she's a whole teenager maybe she's gonna go to college now maybe later who knows but this is Fadia baker this is sabrina's daughter whom she loves with all of her heart it's crazy she just loves her so much and let's talk about a couple of things very quickly in in the previous episode or the most recent episode that I uploaded that is the Anderson family episode I discussed the college thing so I will discuss it again so Fadia she has 11 days left what I do in my game is I have my sims they go off to college at like nine days like they leave that night and, and you'll see like when it happens and if if you really want to see then you're gonna have to go like keep track of the Anderson family because Sophia she's on track to go because she wants to go so she's on track to go um we don't know yet we're just gonna see what Fadaya we don't really know she just has to roll the want to go to college now um yeah so when it hits 10 days when it hits 10 days when it says become becomes an adult in 10 days that's when i will have the opportunity to lock in the want to go to college if she doesn't roll that one i can't lock it in right but anytime i see it then i'll be able to, to lock it in and the way that i play my game she will be able to go off to college like that won't be a problem she'll be able to go off to college and do whatever she wants to do or not go she doesn't have to go now i don't have that mod in your game where basically it's a mod that they have where you can not have your teenage sim go to college but they don't get a bad memory i personally feel like if you didn't go and if the game generated that you weren't gonna have like a good memory from that then that's just what it's gonna be because i'm gonna give i give my sims ample opportunity like there there isn't really a cutoff time for when my sims can go off to college just because of the way that i play like my my gameplay my game style play like the way that i play my sims are in college for a, a long time <laughs> so that's kind of like how that goes the only thing is is that like if she doesn't roll it when she hits the 10 day marker if she doesn't roll it when she hits 10 days that's okay but i just have to keep an eye out for that because like if she gets to nine days or maybe even eight days and then she rolls the want to go to college the only thing that happens is she will become an adult in college for me like the way that i keep up with my timing and stuff like that she will become an adult in college and it'll affect her adult life when she leaves college because technically like her being in college it'll take maybe like a day or two away while she is an adult hopefully that's like making sense the next thing to talk about is inheritance because she is going to go off to college and Sabrina is becoming an elder so that's why it's important to talk about inheritance so this house will belong to Fadaya now with the way that Sabrina lives her life and the way that Fadaya will be living her life I do not foresee for Fadaya moving back in immediately um she may get like an apartment or something like that but i don't see her just moving back in i really don't 
I don't see her moving back in and trying to stay here with her mom. And she wants to do her own thing, you know? Like, <laughs> they both want to do their own thing when it comes to the romantic lifestyle. And I kind of don't want those, I don't want it to clash, you know? You, you kind of have to, like, think about that. But also, I don't think Fadai would want her mom to feel like, oh, well, you have to stay here and do X, Y, and Z. Like, no, I'm a grown, I'm a grown Sim now. I'm an adult Sim now. <laughs> like, I can do whatever I want to do, especially if she does decide to go off to college. And she's definitely going to be like, oh, yeah, I can do whatever I want to do. So, yeah, basically, this house will belong to Fadaya when Fadaya leaves college, if she goes. If she goes to college, this house will belong to Fadaya. She doesn't have to live in it now. Um, she can wait until Sabrina is like getting closer to when it's time for her to not be around. Then Fadaya can like move in and have this home for herself. You know, it's like it's free property. Come on. <laughs> Generational wealth. Come on, people. But anyways, so yeah, that is the plan with that we I just told you about the college plan and you'll see it play out I just told you about the college plan and I just told you about the inheritance plan that I kind of have in place but you guys are gonna really like how I play college it's, it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun I'm gonna have a good time I know I'm gonna have a good time <laughs> okay so this is Padaya Baker she becomes an adult in 11 days she is a pleasure sim we don't care about her LTW I haven't even checked her LTW because we don't care she's a teenager it's gonna change we only care when she becomes an independent teenager i.e. when she has like nine days left or when she is a young adult that's the only time we really start caring about LTWs at least the way that I play so I don't even care to look at them she wants to go to college which is great hopefully she just keeps re-rolling this want she wants to go out with Orlando have three first dates and go out with Freaky. She fears anything happening to Imani, Andres, and Fatima. Okay, so she is a public school student. She has an A+. Plus, and she is also in music theory, so basically like band. And she plays the guitar, so she does go tomorrow she does go tomorrow and it says negative 150 simoleons because that's how much Sabrina has to pay for her to be a part of the band it costs money so yeah that's kind of how that goes oh yeah oh my gosh okay Fadaya's reputation level is a sociable celebrity I, that's good I'm just saying oh snap okay so she is an Aries just in case you have forgotten and of course she has a new bio because y'all know the work I put in. Don't even play with me. Okay, so Fadaya's bio. Fadaya has followed her parents' paths in life and has decided that she will live her life to the fullest. She just wants to go out and have fun and maybe meet a few sims on the way. Why go to a university when you have the life of your dreams in front of you? Besides, it is ridiculous to go to a university for a slacker degree or maybe she should go you can go on more dates and do other things while there yeah so <laughs> if Fadaya does decide that she would like to go to college and or university she's just gonna go to play y'all like I'm not even I'm not even about to play. I, you know, I'm just going to be real with y'all. She's going to go to play around. And that's just, that's just what it is. I already know this, you guys, okay? I already know what's up. So, <clears throat> her hobby is music and dance. And her hobby is playing the guitar. And it is outside. Sabrina got that for her, like, when she was, like, a baby because she knew that Fadaya just absolutely loved it she was like okay well we're just gonna get it then <laughs> whatever you want I buy whatever I buy is for you <clears throat> okay sorry guys excuse me um it's like a wind chill that's coming around and it's like making it really cold so it was like hot like literally burning up about 
three days ago and it's been freezing cold for the past two days so excuse that okay so the last memory that we looked at for Fadaya was that Fantasia got an A plus as you can see a lot has happened since we have looked at Fadaya or since we've like played Fadaya and that's what I be saying so much happens okay so she made a BFF with her sister and I will go and show you guys her family tree this is her half sister she did become BFFs with her half sister she made two BFFs and then she made three BFFs then she met Orlando Bertino who is an NPC teenager and she met him because she brought him home from school in the previous episode then she asked Orlando on a date because she wanted to go on a date. She was attracted to him, to him and I was like, I mean, he's here. <laughs> Why not? Then she kissed Orlando for the first time. She made out with Orlando. And then she had a dream date with Orlando, which is great. Then she met Troy Go, who is an NPC. And she met Troy here at their house because, of course, their mother, you know. <laughs> well, not their mother, her mother, of course. So then she met Andres Edwards. Andres is Chaquel Edwards' cat. Like I said before, Chaquel, he threw a Saturday get-together and their whole household was invited. So that is how Fadaya met Andres Edwards. Oh, she met Chaquel. Oh, yeah, she did because he, he greeted her. Yeah. So she met Chaquel Edwards. Then she met Joe Carr, who is an NPC. She met Yaa Anderson. Oh, okay. Then she met Bamsey Tom Yoy, who is an NPC. She met Neela Ziegler. And then she met Toby, Toby Brunig, who is an NPC. And she made a BFF with Ricky. Okay. Girl, don't get too close to Ricky. <laughs> Go on. Ricky just might be here for a good time, not a long time. Oh, but look at the, look at the chemistry bolts. <laughs> Y'all, no, but look at this with Ash. Y'all, he is date number three that we are going to be working on. <laughs> we are definitely trying to do date number three. But anyways, okay, so let me show you her family. Okay, so this is her mom. The, of course, Sabrina. This is her dad, Fadil King. This is her half-sister, Fantasia. And this is her other half-sister, Tariah Nelson. Here is her family tree. As you can see, here's the tree. There's Fadil. There's Sabrina. And these Sims are not in this household. So Sabrina did not birth these babies. These all come from Fadil's side of the family. So yeah, this is her half sister and this is her other half sister. So yeah, that is Miss Fadaya. We will see if she continues to roll the want to go to college and we will go from there. Where is you guys here's Fatima this is Sabrina's cat Sabrina's cat has been with her forever she is just as attention seeking as Sabrina you know <laughs> no she wants more she wants it more but that's okay you know it's okay Sabrina loves her but golly girl like <laughs> get your own cat you know like like get your own like you know like what <laughs> this is Fatima Baker and she is 32 days old so mm, I don't want anything to happen to her but you know old age and she is in showbiz she is a star and she makes 847 simoleons and she doesn't need any skills or anything like that she is chilling she's at the top of her career <clears throat> so yeah now that we've gone through absolutely everything and I've reminisced on, you know, Sabrina, my baby. So we can go ahead and start the gameplay now. <sighs> Y'all just don't understand. Like, I just... I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, y'all do not understand. He's like, I'm sick. Okay, he's probably, like, hungry or something. Because Sabrina's hungry. <laughs> oh, what's wrong with you? You're healthy. Okay, so let's water. Let's water your plants, baby. I'm trying to get a good angle so you guys can see. Sickly, 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 sickly. Oh! Maybe you shouldn't have watered it.
Oh. That. Whoa. That plant don't look good. That one didn't need water. Oh, wait, what? Talk about a green thumb. Sabrina has learned to understand the secret language of plants and all that work has produced a gold gardening talent. But wait, what? Where, where is that? Here? Oh, oh my gosh. Girl, can you join the gardening club? Oh my gosh, these are sickly though. But the oh my gosh, that's okay. I think that's all we can do, girl. We might have to make it bigger so she can, you know. But honestly, hold on, let's check the food bowl. What is this? Okay, yeah, no, let's let's fill that. I'm going to have her change into her formal. And she's going to take some pics, y'all. Sabrina is getting older. She's like, what is this teenager doing here? Y'all, she's in her pajamas and everything. And then once she takes her pictures, I'm going to move the... um the picture thingy back outside because Fatima, I had to move her bed for it. Oh my gosh, you guys. Sabrina looks so happy. Yeah, she's not gonna be happy about Aiden. Like if they're not, I don't think they're gonna stay lovers, you know? I really don't. Y'all look at her outfit. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. She looks so good. That is so Sabrina, bro. Period, period. I don't know how I feel about her taking pictures in here. Because um, Talon and that other Sim, woohoo, in this. <laughs> so, uh, Y'all look at her, look at, look at her. Oh, y'all the bookcase. Not the bookcase in a way. <laughs> Yo, look at Sabrina. Oh my gosh, girl. Period. I love that outfit on her. Like <gasps> she looks so fire. Period, period. And period, 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 period. Okay, babes. I know. <laughs> Fatima's like, where is my bed? I'm sorry, Fatima. Okay, I'm gonna have her deposit three grand into yeah. her bank account. Yeah. Oh, look at Fatima. She's a show bed. Okay. Okay, babes. You definitely deserve to get some sleep. Okay, it's okay here. She's gonna use the bathroom. She's gonna take a bubble bath. Cause it's time for her to say goodbye. You know, it's time for her to say goodbye to this phase of her life, you guys. Okay, yeah, she, ah, oh, no. Okay. While she's doing that, we're gonna speed past it. I'm gonna call service. And then she's gonna get some leftovers. Okay, Fadaya is still asleep. Good, she should get some sleep. She is starving. Girl, I was starving you, basically. I can hear Fadaya snoring. Repairman ASAP. We gotta make sure that that computer is working. I think this is in the way. Yes, go ahead and charge me. Okay, wait. I feel like I just heard a symphoning over something. Oh. Yeah, these are Fadayas. Okay. Oh my gosh, 
y'all show. And I love this, like, outfit on her. This reindeer outfit. <laughs> it's so funny because it's like, you wouldn't expect her to wear something like that. Does Sabrina like... Oh, y'all, I didn't, she didn't even need the counter. Oh, my gosh, whatever. What ifs? What ifs? Y'all, she was about to eat this good food. Oh, girl. That... <laughs> that was nowhere near enough. I'm gonna have her get some more. Why not eat at, like, four in the morning? No one cares. Okay, look, she does need the counter now. Oh man, this is crazy, you guys. I literally can't believe this. So much has happened in this, like. Sabrina has gone through so much, you guys. I'm so happy for Sabrina. Okay, baby cakes. Oh, <laughs> stop chewing, please. Let's put all of this up. Are you? Are you? Mm, okay. She's gonna leave it because she's <laughs> she's not that neat, y'all. She's she's really not. Gosh, I'm so freaked. What do you think about? Uh huh. Going steady. Who? Girl, I needed another thought bubble on that. You can't just end like that. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look. And then it's the picture of the dyer right there when she was a child with her chubby cheeks. This is like perfect. Okay, so Sabrina, she's going to go ahead and get some sleep when someone wakes up probably Fadaya. when someone wakes up then i will be back Fadaya is waking up she has rolled some fresh ones and she has a money sign up so she's probably earned five thousand yep earned five thousand simoleons and that's literally from her bank account you guys <laughs> that bank account mod is like the best thing ever <laughs> I'm surprised she didn't make, she's very neat, so I'm surprised she, well, she's not that neat. Palm girl isn't that neat. <laughs> um, she probably, honestly, clean this bathroom. I'm just doing that just so I make sure I don't, like, show her, you know, y'all know I try not to show these sims, but, you know, it's not that type of, we, we're not playing that type of game. We just not. We just not. Okay, so she's just cleaning. She really wants to talk to a sim that she can go on a date with. <laughs> oh, yeah, and that toilet looks bad now. Okay. So that really wasn't a bad idea for her to clean that. Whew. Oh, Fatima. Are you going to sleep? Oh, no, you're not. Okay. Because she's definitely going to come and cuddle you. So, uh, give her a hug. And then, what else? And then she's going to stroke Fatima. Y'all, look at Fatima. She's just waiting to be receiving this affection. <laughs> she's so cute with her tail. I can't, y'all. Halima, like, not being here in this neighborhood anymore makes me so sad. Aww. Aww. Yeah, so she doesn't have the want to go to college right now, so we just kind of have to keep an eye on it. I don't know, you know. She may change her mind. She may not. Mm. She's gonna compost that. Her mother would love that. That's 
Was Sabrina White? Where is Sabrina going? Okay. Oh, and as you can see, I put the bed back and I also put the photo booth back. I had to move the photo booth inside because if not, she was going to change into her winter wear. Oh, they look sickly. Healthy, sickly, 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 sickly. Y'all, it's not Sabrina's fault. It's my fault. I don't know what I'm doing. Fatima, what are you doing? Oh, y'all, I thought she was. Oh, my gosh. I was about to be so mad. She does have an alarm on her car, so, you know, that's what she got to do, you feel me? Yes. Get up in there. There you go. I'll be trying to let y'all see how they, like, bag out and stuff. Oh, she's gone. Okay. <laughs> okay, so she's gone. Sabrina is still asleep. When Sabrina wakes up, then I will be back. Sabrina is waking up, and <laughs> the repair woman just came, and she is, like, fawning over Sabrina. She's like, she is so beautiful. Yes, Sabrina is very beautiful. And she knows this. She knows this, you guys. This, this is nothing new to Sabrina. Oh, girl, aren't you making your bed, girl? Period. Okay, that is up and running. Awesome. Okay. Y'all, she really wants to be friends with Naldo. But I don't know if we should, like, do that. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, cause look at, look at them, like, okay, but sh this is what she wants, and he's at work, of course he is, okay, let's call another sim then, let's try Jay, Oh, look at that. Y'all, Jay is always, like, free. I don't know what he does. Can my friend come over, too? Yeah, sure. Y'all, Sabrina would not care. Where is Fatima? Fatima! You know Sabrina loves you. Like, this is all she had when she came here. It was just her and Fatima. That was it. No other sounds. Oh, oh. Oh. I love this one girl. I just can't. The next phase of her life is like, you know. Oh my gosh. Fatima, where are you going? Oh, Fatima has to go to work. Oh. Oh, and some Sims are here. Period. Y'all, I forgot Fatima has to go to work. Fatima, you better be back for the party. Okay, she's going to greet Jay. Who is this? Okay. Oh. You're already... Do you... Does she know you? Oh, she does. Oh, you're the bartender. Oh, a lot of Sims know this bartender, y'all. She's like, girl, you can't. Oh, okay, whatever. She's like, that girl was in the way. Girl, she's gone and she is watching a movie. <laughs> Oh, 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 period, period, period. Oh, he already knows what I'm saying. Okay, so she wants to go on a date. Propose what? Huh? Give pet? Oh, no, move in. Oh, no. <laughs> 
Y'all, I clicked on the wrong thing. Okay, so let's ask on a date. We want her to be very happy by the time she ages up. She's like, we should go on a date. He's like, yeah, let's go. What's that? Have a good reputation. Girl. Oh, he's a knowledge sale. Okay. Oh, look at this. Fears getting married to her baby daddy and getting married to Carlos, even though she's not in love with him anymore. Oh my, oh my. Okay, so. All right, y'all already know what we about to do. <laughs> oh, he wants to have a pillow fight. Oh no, it's a fresh one. Oh, he wants to slow dance. Okay, let's do what he wants to do. Look at Kelly, she's like, am I intruding? Did y'all fall in love? Who fell in love? Who fell in love? He fell in love. Oh my gosh, yes. What did I say? We were gonna have another lover already, period. Okay, Um, and I'm so glad that her wants changed because she is still very much... She doesn't want to lose Aiden as a lover. And y'all, I'm trying not to like. Look at the rose. It's so. Oh, I like that it does that to them. They're like, oh. Okay. So, what does he want to do? Because she wanted to talk. That's why we did that. Okay, have pillow fight. Give back rub. Okay, but. Okay. Um, let's do a suggestion. Are you gonna fall in love with this honey? Look at Kelly, she's like, what? What are y'all doing over there? Honey, mind your own business. Girl, you just fell in love with me, girl. Look at this. Get married to Raymond. Get married to Booker? Sis. Y'all don't even... Oh, she just fell out of love. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Woohoo! What <laughs> Y'all, what's going on? What? Okay, wait. What? Y'all, she is. <laughs> okay, wait. Let's. Okay. She just. Okay, because they. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's make that up. Let's have them make out. Um. She wants a dream date. She also wants to woo with 20 different sims. Oh, he wants to woo in the car? No, that's her daughter's car. Y'all, she is going through every lover imaginable in her mind. There's Jay. There's Neil. That's the first. That's her first lover. <gasps> Badiah's grades are slipping. And then get married to Raymond. Badiah, you got to do your homework, honey. Oh, where y'all going? Oh, girl. <laughs> hey, I'm like, what What y'all finna do? Did you bring someone? Girl, who did you? <laughs> girl, who did you bring this time? What are your grades looking like? Oh, a B plus? Girl. Oh, she's not attracted to him. Okay. Y'all, I thought I saw another Sam. Okay. She may have time to go on a date. <sighs> Y'all, she just... She never really wants to do her homework. So, like... I mean, I know... I don't really just base it on... Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> I don't just base it on that. I also, like, roll for it. Okay, so Fadaya, she's going to come do her homework. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad that I rolled. That she is going to be... Y'all, look how much homework she has to do. Too much is the answer. Too much. Oh my gosh. Y'all, look at Orla... I mean, who is that, Randy? Girl, who did you bring home? Oh, his name is Randy. Y'all, I thought that was Orlando. And look at them talking... Oh. Can they get out? <laughs> They're about to woohoo. She's like, can y'all get out? They're like, okay, sorry. Cause what? Uh-uh. 
Y'all, we're over here with Fadaya. Oh, cussing. <laughs> okay. Um, they definitely just woohoo. She wants the woman with 20 different sins, but she also wants a dream date with Jay. Huge reason why I did what I just did. Okay, great. They're going to change out. Girl, can you give him a little... You know, caress him a little bit. We're going to go back over here with them. They are lovers now, you guys? Oh, that's what he wanted. I was going to say, that's not what she wanted. He still wants the woohoo in his cart. Sir, it's not happening, okay? She's going to make her bed. And then um, we're going to wait to end the date because we're going to make the bed first because it's going to be a whole bunch of sims over here, y'all. And when I mean, like, when I mean a whole bunch of sims, I mean, like, a bunch of sins and this could get like real real crazy so okay um she's gonna end the date look how she's walking look at the walk oh uh, girl you and oh uh, girl I literally cannot stop it, girl. Y'all look at <laughs> I don't think she's gonna oh no. Oh okay, she is. Oh uh-huh. Uh, -huh. uh Kelly's like, yeah girl, do that girl. Sabrina's like, girl Oh, Sabrina, why are you running? Yo <laughs> I told y'all I told her to go there. I didn't Girl, you want to buy a hot tub? Y'all, she might have to get herself a hot tub. I might have to do that for home, girl. Okay. Um. Y'all had her go inside. Knowing. God dang on well. I don't know what we're going to do for her. Okay. What? Oh, talk to. Girl, talk to. Talk to these plants. Because. What's wrong with them? Okay, we're definitely gonna have to see that interaction. Yeah, her fun is so low. <laughs> oh my gosh. She still has to go to school tomorrow, so. That'll be okay. Oh my gosh. Y'all, she has to leave in like 30 minutes. Oh, snap. She will be back in time for her mother's party. So that won't be so bad. Dang. Y'all just thought about that. But she did all of that homework in like. What time did she get home? Like 1, maybe 1 30? 1 30, 2 Y'all, she did all of her homework in like 3. Almost 3 hours. She is going to have to go to work though. What happened? Oh, Fatima got some <laughs> shimmery. Oh, look at the, the plant is so happy. <laughs> Sabrina, yeah, she looks so crazy right now. Y'all, that's so funny. Oh my gosh, I can't. Okay, stop talking to that one. We're going to let her talk to it for a little bit. Y'all, she really needs to go. I feel like I hear a car. Okay, no, I don't. Okay. Excuse me. Guess I'm going crazy. Okay, she's almost done. Girl, you need to run. First day of band practice. And, or her first time going to band practice. And it's just not going to be good. 
her off or something. Oh, oh you guys. It, oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. Girl, keep doing it. Oh, my gosh. It was sickly, and now it's, like, healthy. Kadai, are you leaving? Okay, great. Yeah, Kadai needs to go ahead and head out. Can it get any healthier? I don't know. Okay, let's stop talking to it. Let's talk to another one. Okay, she's gone. Okay, it's still sickly. Hopefully this helps it. Y'all, look at the plants. They're like looping over. Oh, it's going up. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, it's healthy now. Oh my god. Y'all, maybe the reason why our our plants die is because we don't talk to our plants. Maybe they're lonely. Okay, that was already healthy. Oh, period. Maybe it'll get even healthier. I don't know. Y'all, I can't believe the print is gonna go up. Oh, I can't. I know. <sighs> okay, stop talking to your plants, baby. Oh my gosh. <sighs> it's about that time. It's about that time. Okay, sorry. <laughs> okay. What we're gonna do is, okay, look at Jay. We're gonna go ahead. Oh, somebody's calling. Okay, never mind. Hold on. Let's uh, let's do that first. She's gonna answer the phone. And I don't have to put all of this stuff outside because y'all, I don't want my Sims to freeze. I really don't. Don't y'all hear that? Is it? No, she's not. What is that sound? Is that just... I know that's not... Y'all, I know that's not just me. I hear like a car sound. But there's no car outside. Y'all, it's the cars passing by. Okay, let's, let's just go ahead and throw this back in the car. Okay, she's gonna throw this birthday party. And Fadaya, she'll be in home in time. She'll be back home in time. <laughs> okay, five guests. <laughs> okay, mm, two, three, four, five. Look how many sims that she has to call. Y'all, oh my gosh. Okay. Mm. I should have put that mod in my game that allows you to invite more sims. Um, I'm okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna gloss over this part because yeah. I'm gonna gloss over this. I'm gonna go ahead and get everything set up for the birthday party. I'm gonna have her manually. Yes, I said manually. Manually call all these sims to invite them over. And I will see you guys when I'm done. So, Fadaya is pulling up. I want to show y'all Fadaya pulling up. <laughs> oh yeah, and she's still liking my <laughs> Oh, it's taking forever. But that's okay, that's okay. My parties don't really start till later anyway. Oh, I don't think Charlie would come, but he might. <laughs> okay, yeah. She got 150. Yeah, it cost her 150 simoleons. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Okay, so. Fadaya is going to come over here and turn on some music. I don't know if this will like. Yeah, she's looking at the snow. Okay, girl. Mm -hmm. Now y'all know I'm gonna speed past this part. Y'all already know this. As long as we all know. 
Oh, Charlie's coming. Okay. Y'all, I think the deal has to work. I'm not gonna lie. She's gonna turn on. I feel like she would do jazz just because I feel like Sabrina is a jazz type of girl. <laughs> I don't know why, I just do. Okay, so Fadaya is gonna invite her own sims. Oh my gosh, Aiden came out here for one. They like, what you doing out here? <laughs> Like he didn't come over because his lover called him. Okay. Alright, alright. Ash. No, come on. Okay, fine. She is like a sim into music, but also her dad is here. Oh, well, he's eating. Okay. Where's her little sister? Now, if Sakari's here, Fantasia's here somewhere. I think she is. She's gonna go give her sister a hug. Her sister is here. Why not? Why not? Yeah, I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm nervous about what's going on out here. Cause Danny and Wanda seem a little too cozy. You know what I'm saying? Okay, he walked away. <laughs> Y'all like it? Why I like it? Okay, Darnell isn't coming. That's okay. Okay. This man is thinking about babies. Yeah, I'm just watching all of these sims. Okay, let's just follow Padaya. Oh, um, yeah, she just called over Goa. Okay. There's a con! Oh my, I forgot. Oh my gosh. It's okay though. It's gonna be okay, it's gonna be okay. Mila? Did she greet Mila? And then hug, oh, Darkwiz! And then hug Friendly, and then entertain with the inside joke. She could probably also play Tickle. Or is there like a dance option? Yeah, they're both into music. That's actually perfect for them. Okay. She's calling the rest. Let's see. Benjamin Long, and then it's that other male stem, and that's it. They're all like, oh, Sabrina is so beautiful. Yes, yes, she is. Where, where's my married couple? Y'all, where are, um, okay. I feel like they got in here. I could be wrong though. It's like it's always a pleasure. I'm coming over immediately. Y'all, where are we? What's happening? Oh. <laughs> we're gonna be speeding this up. Where are they all trying to go? Okay, this is the last thing. He is tearing up a little period. Y'all, she just knows so many sins. Invite over, yes. Last Sam, she's gonna block these candles. Let's get the party started. Aw, they're out here talking. 
She's gonna go get dressed and blow out some candles. Thank you, thank you. Oh, he's like Safari is fine. Okay, oh, I know, you wanna dance together. Okay, Wanda is here, so I got kind of confused. She's gonna go change. It'll be time for the party. Well, I mean, it's been time. Like, the party's been going on, basically. Gonna say snoozer? Yeah. She's about to age up. Here's Benjamin. Jimmy! Ah, Y'all, she's having so much fun playing with her little sister. Y'all, Fatima went inside and went to sleep. Because she can't. And yes, Sabrina did invite all of her lovers, you guys. Yes. <laughs> they all deserve to see her age up, you know? Okay, now it's not bad. Period. Because this needs to be a good birthday party. Period. Oh, you're freezing. Okay. Oh my gosh, y'all. It's her outfit for me. She's just smiling. Oh my gosh. Girl, you look bomb. Because she was sleeping in the bed. Why were you sleeping in the bed, honey? Oh, uh, there's the Daya. I don't see the deal, but I do see these other sims. There's the Campbell family. You know, even though they don't know. What they don't know won't hurt them. Look at Goa. Look at my sims. Yes, girl, blow it out. Girl, not you think about Jay, because, uh-uh. Y'all know I roll for this, but Raymond Boffman and Abjeet Depay said they're both aging up with her. You've made it. Now that you're an elder, use the phone to call work and retire if you want. You've got a big pension coming. Uh, yay! Oh. How you looking, honey? How you feel? Girl, you oh, she's over here wooing over now, though. Okay. <laughs> Y'all, why, why they got my girl in this Santa Claus outfit? Y'all looking so pretty though. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I can't wait to, you know, fix her up and make her look good. You feel me? Y'all already know what's up. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. Uh, you know what's funny? I feel like the is the type that will leave her own party to go fix herself up, to be honest. <laughs> Looks like there's a lot that's about to happen. Hopefully, nothing too crazy happens right now. <laughs> He's like, oh, Sabrina, you still look so beautiful. Okay, so she's gonna hug Sophia because that's her friend. 
And she did come. Like, thanks for coming. Oh, she didn't even hug her dad. Yeah, I don't know where, I don't know what Fadil is. Yeah, he's somewhere. Oh, there he is. <laughs> There's Fadil. Okay, she should hug her family first, because that's her dad. Can I ask permission to go out? And as you can see, hold on. Let me show you. It's past 6 o'clock. It says, become an adult in 10 days. She hasn't rolled the one to go to college. So when she rolls it, then I can lock it in. But until then, there's nothing that I can do. Okay. Oh, oh, Hopefully nothing crazy happens, y'all. We oh, over here looking at these things. Okay, we got eight. Okay. <laughs> They're still <laughs> Y'all, I, I enjoy this type of chaos. Not the other type, but this type, yes. Um, uh, yeah, do a little inside jokey joke. That's her dad, y'all. And then, y'all, they can talk about music. <laughs> and then, she'll call Tobias. Because she spent time with her sister. Okay, some other sims, they're just, they're aging up. Okay, there's Raymond. And Abjeet, he just aged up too. Hey, y'all, look at these sims. She is spawning over Damien. Okay, Wanda. Mary, pregnant lady. Calm it down, ma'am. Calm it down. Great, this is a good party for I'm glad that period of my life is over. Seems like there's nowhere to go but up and here at the same outlook. Oh, Aiden, he's in the bathroom. Yeah, y'all are just gonna have to wait. <laughs> Not you being attracted. Did go and take your peas? No, he didn't. Okay. Okay, you come eat this also. Y'all already know. Where's that? Aspiration reward. Now look how many like rewards she has. So we're gonna give her well it is. And then Okay. And then we'll give her this one for work. So she can have four if we complete her LTW and get to that secondary aspiration. Oh, she's chilling as an elder. She's like some Yeah, there's so much going on. Okay, let's try not to show Aiden. So I have to kind of do like a bird's eye view so y'all can see all the different things. Y'all, Sierra Langerak almost aged up into an elder, so that was kind of interesting. So come talk to, um, let's do this the right way. You got FG, oh, look at that, okay. Not too much, look at that with baby daddy boy. Ain't nothing changed over there. Girl, this is your, this is your boo thing. Why don't you come talk about nature? Yeah, cause he wants a high five, but we not, we not doing it. She just aged up. Okay, let's admire. Thanks for coming. Oh, they're best friends. That is so crazy, considering. What's happening? Watch fight. <gasps> no, y'all. Fadil and her. Con oh my gosh, look at this. Look at Fadil and her con fighting. But are you okay? She's like no. Oh, she's looking at the snow. Okay, we definitely gotta see you watch this fight. It was somebody definitely. What is this? Get first kiss, huh? We're trying to see her reaction to this first fight. <gasps> no, Fadaya! Y'all! Fadaya, she just be crying. 
What is this? I'll entertain Joe with uh, Joe. Okay. Well, she was just talking to Neil. This is Joe. Okay. Well, let's do that. Let's go then. Entertain with the inside joke. Now, Fadaya, she's running to her back. Oh, my God. That really upset her. Fadaya, are you okay? I didn't. Y'all, she hates to see him fight. Oh, my gosh. I don't know if she even likes old dude now. Okay. Okay. Oh, my gosh. They're still fighting. I... Um, There's only so much you can do, you know? Okay, they're talking about their hobby. She's gonna admire her friends. Then she's gonna entertain. She is fawning over Damien. Okay. She can't even help it. Yeah, all these Sims just dance. Oh, they're fighting. Padaya, no! <laughs> Okay, hopefully. Okay. What is Aiden doing? Is he running? Oh no, he's not running. He's just like, whatever. Okay, okay so she wanted to entertain him with an inside joke. Uh, we're gonna talk about nature. Y'all, they are still fighting. I just, I can't. Alright, what are you doing? Cause Douglas is trying to get his first kiss with you, girl. Oh, she's still upset about that. Oh, Fadaya, it's okay. Girl, I'm okay. Look at the deal. He's so upset. They shouldn't be free. <laughs> They're the ones that's fighting. <laughs> okay. Um, where is this? Oh, that's FG. Where is? Okay, Gola is slapping him in the head. Okay, let's talk to him. Y'all, you know, Zabrina, she gonna keep it safe. Keep it safe. Y'all, Douglas was trying to get his first kiss with the old girl. And I was just like, huh? Oh, okay. What do you want to do for the hand? The deal. Why are you so sad? Well, I don't know, but... anything you want to do? Actually, see if Ash can come. Because, well, why not? She's like, Sabrina is a senior now. <laughs> That's how the car is looking. She's like, Sabrina is out of the game. She is an old lady. Girl, don't push it. Okay, I think Hakan and Fadil are staying away from each other. I don't know. I don't know. I think someone is playing with Fadil. <laughs> yes, Ash. Try to see if you can come over now. Someone is in the tub. Oh, he's coming over. Yeah, she's gonna crimp. Make sure she looks good. She's gonna ask him on a date. Oh, whoa, wait. Oh no, they're not lovers. Are they? Okay. I don't think. Uh -oh. oh, Douglas is attracted to her. Oh, girl, you probably should ask Douglas on a date. Douglas wanted his first kiss so bad. She probably should have done that. All right, y'all, Sabrina's gonna do what she always does, which is leave. <laughs> Even though it's a party for her, she always leaves, you know? She just does. Uh, no, she's not taking anyone. She's like, Fadaya, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Fadaya's the only person she would tell. She's gonna go buy some new clothes. Stop the party anyways. They really are. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Everybody's kind of chilling now. 
Lakan and Fadil, they were fighting. They're done fighting, I guess. This was one of his first kids with uh, Fadaya, apparently. Some of these things aren't going to leave, though. Look at Fantasia. Girl, it's a school night. You should be getting home. Okay, they were just doing something. Okay. Where is Ash? Ash, are you here yet? Y'all, cause she definitely invited him over. Y'all, I knew the cops. I knew they would come. Look at the cops. Just look at them. Like, we can't ever have a good time. There's level. <laughs> they're fighting again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're fighting again. Y'all stop fighting! Oh lord, Badaya. Don't look! Oh my gosh. Y'all, they are not okay. <laughs> She's about to leave! Oh my gosh, and she is acting out. Where's Ash? Because, honestly, she is sick of them and this fighting. Like, why are the deal? She's like, why are you fighting? Like, you fight with so many Sims. It's insane at this point. Are you leaving? No, I think he's going like the other way around. Y'all, this police officer is about to shut this party down, y'all. Oh, you guys, Fantasia ran in here too. Okay, let's let, let's give her a comforting hug, cause she's not okay. Okay, where is Sabrina? <laughs> yeah, Sabrina's gonna leave. Okay, this party's too loud. Let's break it up, people. So Ash, I guess she's not trying to call him over again. But y'all, Sabrina, she's about to leave. So <laughs> we're gonna head over to Sabrina. She's gonna go to the store, get some clothes, change her whole look, and then. When we come back, we'll be back with Badaya. Sabrina just pulled up. Sabrina. Oh, there's Carlos. Okay, I'm gonna have her come and use the restroom. Girl, what was that? Was that dance? Were you gonna dance? Oh, there's Damien. Okay, okay. She's like two lovers. Well, Carlos isn't a lover anymore. But. Okay, you guys. This is the look that Sabrina has chosen to go with. I know is different her hair is usually like down and long and all that kind of stuff but i like different and this is what she chose this is what she likes this is what she wants now i have like a short hairstyle and i put it on her and i was like man she would look good with like something like more like up and short and this is it this is what she wants. This is the direction that we're going in, you guys. Okay. Also, let me have her come like right here so you guys can see what she looks like. So you guys get the full picture of Sabrina. Can you come up right here, maybe? Okay, you're like, well, okay, it's fine. It, it's, uh, okay, we, we, 
we can make this work okay so this is like her full outfit from her shoes up i kind of wanted you guys to be able to see like what's kind of like going on there it's just she's like standing in front of this so um but yeah there's this like lace with the rose and this is a custom dress gorgeous gorgeous and this is what she's looking like with her glasses. She got some wrinkles on her forehead. She doesn't have too many wrinkles, though, to be honest with you. She really doesn't. Um, she looks good. Yeah, she looks good. I, this is so different. I would not have thought that she would want this type of hairstyle. I really wouldn't. I would have never guessed. Y'all, look at the Sims busting out game in the back. Do y'all see that? Oh, yeah. But yeah, this is Sabrina. This is what she is looking like. She had a great birthday party. She still fears like falling out of love with Aiden, but I mean, he's married, so I'm not going to be entertaining that. That's something that they would have to entertain themselves. Uh, I wish there was a way to show y'all all of her outfits. Like, this is almost like a fashion show, you know? Yeah, so all of these Sims showed up after her birthday party kind of ended. Because it's like 2 in the morning. After her birthday party ended, all of these male Sims kind of showed up. I'm going to have her come greet Goopy. Because her type is like black hair. Also, Carlos, he was trying to like flirt with her. But, uh, uh, -uh. First of all, all of her lovers are here. It's like three lovers here. What's Benjamin doing? Sweet talk. Oh no. Go away, Benjamin. Benjamin. Not Benjamin. Benjamin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. How you feel about Goofy? Nothing happened. Whoa. Three chemistry books? You know, I'm not surprised. Go away, Benjamin. Go away. Actually, how you feel? Girl. Y'all, she doesn't have to be home. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. She doesn't have to be home right now. So, I mean, they can at least, you know, talk. Entertain with a joke. It's so funny. Now that she's an elder. Actually, this started, like, right before she became an elder. She's just been wanting more of, what is this, network? Because it has to be, okay. She's just been wanting more of, like, to woo -woo with the sim. Instead of, like, being lovers. I don't, you know, I don't know. She's like, I don't have that much time. <laughs> Life is not guaranteed. I don't have that much time left. Y'all, she looks so different. I mean, I think it's a good different. I do. I think it's a good different. I wouldn't want her to, like, look the same. What is this? What are you doing? What? You are simply the coolest in my minute ages. I'm going to spread the words to everyone I know. Sabrina, your reputation is on its way up. Actually, her reputation is very good. She appreciates that, though. Look at the deal. He's like, what are you doing? He's like, why are you talking to him? He's like, why are you talking to him? Our daughter's at home by herself. Why are you talking to him? It's like four in the morning. <laughs> Y'all, I can't wait to do this. He is so funny. I really can't. Look at him. He's like, Sabrina, you look good as an elder, too. Crazy. <laughs> She's fawning over Damien. Of course she is. Okay, so Dylan and Damien just met. Interesting. Okay. Homegirl is about to go home. Girl, shouldn't you be, like, at home, you're a teenager. Y'all, that's Ivy Cooper. Copper, Cooper, Copper. Copper, Cooper, Copper, 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 Copper. Okay, Sabrina is heading home. When I get back, we're not gonna see Sabrina when she gets there. We're gonna be with Badaya. So, I'll see you guys with Badaya. So, y'all have no idea what just happened. <laughs> so much has just happened, but that's not what we're here to talk about. Okay, so Sabrina will be home in like five hours really really long time that's fine she has her look and everything her new look it's so different and i'm here for it 
I just, I am. Okay, so let's go ahead and play. She told them bye. She's calling them over. Well, not them, but Ash. She's trying to go on a date with Ash, y'all. Y'all, all these Sims, they know they can just, like, leave, right? Like, where is he? Ash. Ash. Y'all, where is Ash? Oh, there he is. Okay. Okay, for some reason, okay, we're just, okay. Um, are you able to talk to Douglas, maybe? Uh, yeah, she's gonna ask Douglas on a date, because ain't nobody got time for all this. I'm trying to get to you through the crowd. Mm. Yeah, she's running. Yeah, I don't know why everyone. Oh, I think some Sims are staying. Oh. Douglas, are you good? Oh, did he just disappear? Okay, um, hmm, okay. I mean, do you, okay, there's nothing going on with you and Aiden and I. Oh my gosh. But he's here though, because I see him in the relationship panel, so. Oh, there he is. And then Ash hasn't moved. Okay, how about we go chat with Ash? Because I don't know what's happening. These Sims, they're trying to leave, which is understandable. Some aren't trying to leave though. She's running. Girl, okay. Oh, snap. Y'all, she is trying to run out there. I'm trying to get you out there. <laughs> All these Sims. Are, oh, girl, did Ashley? Girl, I think Ash left. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, her mom won't be back until like a couple of hours. So. She's gonna try to call him over. It's like 11 though. I don't think he's gonna come because it's like 11 o'clock. She really wants to go on a date with Ash. 
What do you say? Okay, sounds great. He's coming. Okay, great. All these sims are leaving, though. Okay, well, y'all leave then. Y'all, that's the police officer. I'm wondering, like, why the, the police car is still outside. Things are calming down now that Sims are leaving. Sophia, what's wrong? She doesn't want to leave. Girl, you gotta leave. You gotta go home. Take yourself home, honey. Cause, uh, Ash is coming up, I think. Is he here? Y'all, I don't think, y'all. They really could have did something. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> but they can't. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. You guys, I just love her so much. Okay. So, um, the plan was I was going to have her go on a date with Ash. They were going to have a really good date, like basically dream date. Um, and then they were going to be able to do whatever they want to do, even if they wanted to woohoo because Sabrina's not here. So that's the only time my teenage sims can woohoo is if the parent is not at home or if the parent is at home but they have their own double bed because they you deserve a cut scene okay you deserve a cut scene if you are going to woohoo you know what i'm saying like no my sims deserve cut scenes so yeah now they can woohoo like now i was saying before she could woohoo if she had a double bed in her room she could have woohooed with ricky because they were trying to woohoo in the last episode she could have woohooed with ricky but only if she had a double bed in her bedroom that would have been okay but sabrina would have went off she would have went off and she would have been grounded <laughs> but i would have been grounded but you know I still would allow that to happen even if the parents are home. I still let it happen. But not in the parents' bed. Unless the parent is not at home. Those are like my caveats. Because it's to also kind of help like my teenagers not do stuff like that. Because if they do, they could get pregnant. You know, I don't know. You know, it could happen. It could not happen. Who knows? But anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning into the baker family and everything that is happening from the transitions and the new phases of life you know but i right now she doesn't have the want to go to college she may have it like before we come back to them she may roll that want from ta especially from talking with sophia usually it seems like her connection with sophia is what keeps her wanting to go to college because honestly she's having fun right now to be honest she's having fun talking to different um male teenage sims i'm trying to like make sure i say it correctly <laughs> teenage male sims male teenage sims anyways i think it's teenage male sims but anyways she's having fun talking to a bunch of teenage male sims so i feel like she's just chilling she is I, every now and again she wants to go but right now she's chilling but we will Keep on the lookout. Hopefully, Sophia will be able to convince Fadaya to be like, hey, I think you should go to college. I mean, but she just lost her scholarship. She'll get it back when she goes back to school because, period, we're going to make sure she gets that scholarship back. But um, other than that, she did. She did lose her scholarship. So that is something to kind of, you know, kind of keep in mind. But anyway. Her parents don't know that. They don't know that she lost a scholarship. She she knows that she lost it. They don't know that she lost it. Because she should just get another scholarship. Anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning into the Baker family and Sabrina stepping into her golden stage. Yeah, this, this is crazy. <laughs> 
it's just it's moving so fast like my neighborhood is moving so fast like everybody slow down it's okay that's what makes it fun that's what makes it fun because i want it like i said before my goal is to get to 100 years at least you know i haven't gotten there so first but the first the first marker is 50 years and then we can aim for 100 but right now we're only at 30 so we got to put 20 more years under this custom neighborhood's belt i guess i guess i'll see you guys later